Mac and Shay's room. He's actually homesick today, but he's in mummy's bed because whenever kids are sick, they gotta be in mummy's bed. Um, so it's springtime. The sun's trying to break free. You can see a little bit of blue sky up there. Um, Millie's yelling at me because she wants attention. I'm sure you can hear her. Um, but anywho, because spring is basically here and we're not having any more of those intense cold nights, I don't need my burn pile anymore. So what I'm going to do is, that's going to be my bag for the day, is I'm going to go through all of my, um, sorry, burn pile stuff, all the cardboard and everything, and um, recycle the cardboard and shred the papers that need to be shredded because I can't burn them. So I'm going to take... Just 20 minutes to do the stuff that's already upstairs here on the landing that we didn't take downstairs yet um, and sort that out. We have this giant industrial shredder because, um, well, I think the army was throwing one out and Rob got a hold of it. So, yeah, <laughs> repurpose. And, um, but we really needed it because my when my aunt passed away, she kept everything so we had to shred so much stuff <laughs> the recycling guys were very concerned because we had like one day like just 20 bags of paper shred it was so bad we're like you know what let's not burn in our town guys with this we actually took it to the county dump station thank god recycling is free so but that dump station is closed now so i can't do that anymore that'd be so convenient because it was only like at most 20 minutes away now, if we want to go to the dump station, it's like almost an hour. It's ridiculous. Not doing that. Um, oh, cat hair. So, <laughs> that's today. Maybe I'll do a time lapse. I'm not sure. Hey. So, I'm going through all these bags of papers and cardboard and things and whatever doesn't actually need to be shredded, I'm just throwing into this bag to be recycled. Whatever is shredded, I'm tossing on my desk so that way I can take it to our shredder later. Seamus keeps interrupting me, so I have to keep turning around to um, entertain him. The egg cartons I'm going to use for later for gardening. Um, but this was also the fun part because as I was going through these bags, I also found a couple of pieces of laundry that ended up in them. So that's one of the unfortunate things that the PTSD episodes does for my hubby is he doesn't really mindfully put things away. He's just squirreling. He's just putting things into a container so they're somewhere hidden and he knows he can get to them later, even though those containers might actually be for garbage. So one of the things I'm trying to do is trying to avoid having any sort of like bags or um, hardware boxes or anything in the room that he could hide things in. And he, he's totally in agreement with me on this one too. So that's a project. I'm in the hallway where the paper shredder is. And there are Dolbeans. 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 Go ahead, Gigi. Touch the toe beans. The toe beans, the toe beans, yeah. The toe beans, the beans. You look at you like, what are you doing? The beans are growing nice this year. Say hi, Corporal. Yeah. Hi. Oh, he's going to get you. Me, 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 me. He always sleeps with one leggy out. Apparently... He sometimes also puts his tail out, too. Yes. Ring like, like a dig dog dig. <laughs> okay, you go back to napping. Meow meow. You're so soft. Where's Hi, you. Oh, you're the meow meow? Kiss the meow meow. Meow meow meow. Oh, don't press that meow. 